Hello and welcome if you're new to my channel, this is Achol from Creative Achol. Today I would like to give a massive thanks to two beautiful girls and those are uh, Ayan Matur, thank you so much beautiful and Achol God, thank you so much for sharing my videos and for all my subscribers, uh, thank you so much for being so supportive and I would like to take this chance to say happy Easter to all of you and your families and I wish this Easter coming with joy and happiness even though we're going through uh, this coronavirus but we still have to enjoy it and our recipe today is not that hard, it's so simple and this is macaroni bechamel, I uh, wish you guys enjoy it, let's, let's see the ingredient and see how to do it. To make a macaroni bechamel, we need some ingredients. Um, I'm using one kilo of minced beef, one kilo of macaroni. I'm using here cheese, onion, and flour. Those are the main ingredients. And one liter of milk, carrot, and uh, capsicum is choice. You can make the macaroni bechamel without them. And for the spice, I'm using garlic powder, uh, vegetable one spoon of common seed and I'm using one spoon of curry powder it's choice too and I need uh, one big spoon of tomato paste and oil let's go cook the macaroni bechamel and see how it going oh <laughs> we're starting with the onion I put my oil about only two big spoon of oil because the meat will have some spice on it This is enough for my onion. Now I'm going to add in the maybe. My meat is going dry now, but as I mentioned before, there's no water you have to add. Look at the water from the meat. It's a lot of water, so I need this water to dry it. I'm gonna add the spice. And the Now I'm going to put my tomato sauce on the sauce.
now it's time to make my bechamel sauce to make a bechamel sauce you need to heat the oil a bit and then add the flour on it And here is the cheese. The first thing that I'm going to do, I'm going to take the Russian sauce. Some sauce on it. This one, I'm going to be two half. Half down and half up. Because everyone has to get a bit of meat and everything.
after you finish you have to put it in the oven for 30 minutes in 140 degrees don't forget that Hello again guys, this is the end of our video and this is how my macaroni bachamel time to look like I would like you to see inside, that's how it look like, I just took one piece out of it and yep It look nice, pretty and delicious, that's what I feel um, Yeah, let me test my macaroni bachamel Mm. Seriously, it tastes so delicious. 10 out of 10. This is the dish that you surprise your guests with. It looks so nice and delicious. If you're new to my channel, please don't forget to like and subscribe and tell the bell so you can get all the new videos. And don't forget again to share the videos with your friends and relatives. Until we meet again in the next video, I promise it's gonna be even better than this. Bye for now.